Hi everyone, and welcome to our video on deploying Jira Service Management Data Center in a non-clustered architecture. Deploying a non-clustered architecture is quick and simple. If you don't need high availability, we recommend this as your first migration option. Here are some of the advantages of a non-clustered architecture. It's so easy that it only takes a few minutes. You don't need new infrastructure. You can reuse your current server infrastructure and only need to make changes if you want to. For instance, if you anticipate enterprise growth. And lastly, you get immediate access to data centers out of the box features that don't require high availability. By starting with the non-clustered architecture, you can grow into your instance with the option to move to a cluster if your organization's objectives and demands evolve. Now that we've touched on some of the benefits of a non-clustered architecture, let's jump into the deployment process. Deploying data center in a non-clustered architecture only takes two simple steps and you'll be up and running in minutes. The first step is to review and upgrade your marketplace apps to the equivalent data center version. This is a recommended step and should be done prior to your deployment so that all of your apps continue to run properly. For more information on data center apps, visit the link in the description box below. The second and last step in your deployment is upgrading your license key. Open your existing Jira Service Management server instance and navigate to the administration menu. From here, you want to select applications and then versions and licenses on the left-hand side. Enter your new data center license and you're all set. And there you have it. In a few easy steps, you successfully migrated your Jira Service Management instance. Congratulations. Remember, now that you've deployed a non-clustered environment, you can always come back and set up your data center Jira Service Management instance in a cluster. If you're interested in seeing the step-by-step -step documentation for this process, or if you're ready to download a free trial, check out our resources.